Hi people, this is Angel from PRDV Entertainment. Today we start a new chapter of the Unreal Engine. We are not talking about UDK or anything else. In this chapter here, in this tutorial, I'll be teaching you guys how you can add a gun from any 3D software to Unreal Engine and also how you can export any object, a gun, a mesh, anything to another 3D software. First of all, we need to download at least the software. If you're using Blender, you don't have nothing else. Nothing else. You need to download AutoDex FBX Converter. Download that file uh, from their website so you can convert from FBX to an OBG file. Now let's go to the Unreal Engine. Let's export this uh, project here that you you see. It's a project. It's a free project from the Unreal Engine. Comes uh with all the Unreal Engine and everything else from the account. So download that project, it's called a shooting game, and go to your weapons here when you open the project and right click on rifle. After right clicking on rifle, supposed to get a menu, like this one, okay, thank you. Go to export. On export, you need to choose a name, just put a name, maybe the same one, rifle, and leave it as an FBX file. Choose save, and after that, go to the blender, Oh, after that you need to go to your Autodex FBX converter and you need to convert the file to an OBG file. After you have it as an OBG file, you need to get your gun, import it as an object also. So if you haven't exported the gun yet, the gun you just made, export it first as a Wavefront OBG. And after that, I have it right here. I'm going to import this one. There we have our shotgun. Now, maybe some of you guys already have seen this shotgun because I already made a video on um, creating this shotgun when I created. So now we need to import the rifle OBG file. Why? Because we need to know how big uh, that gun has to be and where exactly it has to be. And for that, we need to choose import way front is OBG and we need to choose the rifle. So as you can see, now we can see that there are two guns right here. It's a shotgun that we created and also we have the rifle. Now it's perfectly right where it has to be because I already exported uh, the size and everything on the same place this rifle was before. So you just need to delete uh, the rifle. If you haven't uh, changed the way the gun has to be, the size and everything, just work around a little bit before deleting the rifle so you know what you're doing. And after doing that, we need to add, uh, we need to, first of all, if this mesh is, has different parts, like this one, see, as you can see, it's like uh, a part, every, everything that it has. So we need to parent these parts first before doing, doing anything else. So choose all the parts and for the last one, let's choose the one in the middle. Let's press the control P so we can parent all those objects. What does it does? When you choose this one right here, it moves every object that it has on the gun. Press control C to undo. And now let's let's press shift S. Let's uh, put cur cursor to select it. So it goes. I got come on, don't start. There we go. Now, to select it, why are you selected anyway? It's supposed to be the one select. Oh, anyway, let's add the amateur, present the chip and the A. That's a bone, so we need to add the bone. And now we need to rotate this at least uh, to the X, at least for uh, 180. Exactly, so it goes down. And now we need to pull this inside our gun. So it's right there inside the gun. And now I'm going to pull it down so it goes right into the middle. So there we go. Now we have it right into the middle. So now, uh, after you're doing this, uh, you need to choose every part. Or if it's only one mesh, one object, one complete object, you need to choose every part. And now choose the armature. And let's parent these objects with the armatures. So press Ctrl P and we're going to choose with empty groups. And after that, just go to the object on the uh, on the bottom, go to object, go to apply, 
click on location go to object again apply click on scale now we need to export this file as an FBX so we can import it into the Unreal Engine so go to file export OBG oh my bad uh, Autodesk FBX and now we need to export it remember to to, to deselect empty camera lamp and just uh, leave selected armature and mesh I'm not gonna export it and again because I already exported it is right here so now I'm gonna teach you guys how you can import this gun into the game and for that go to the weapons first right click choose import and now we're gonna choose our shotgun that is the rusty one and remember this you need to choose skeleton mesh because if you don't choose that you will have trouble to get your gun in the game so click on import and there we have our gun so now we double click to see the gun there we go we need to add some materials to this but I'm going to show you guys how to add the materials and how to work with the muscle flashing everything and the bullets on the second tutorial so I'm going to keep on this one so right now we need to add this gun this shotgun to the blueprint called web gun this is the name they gave to this blueprint here that it will be always on the character for any changes that you maybe create something another gun to pick up from the floor or something it only changes the gun so let's double click on web gun and let's choose on the first person uh, mesh view or the third person we can choose our shotgun at the moment I don't need to choose the third person but I'm gonna choose it so now we save it now we close this window here and now let's test our shotgun there we go as you can see like I told you guys we need to work with the muscle flash the bullets and everything so I'll show you guys that on the second tutorial for the guns for adding guns and also I need to work with the animation of the reload because I want that magazine to be on his hat on his hand when he is reloading also I need to work or it has to go yeah I need to his hand well guys this is Angel from PRDV Entertainment see you guys on the next tutorial please hit the like button write a comment please subscribe if you need, if you need anything else just ask me on the comment box and I will uh, contact you soon really quick this is Angel guys Bye.